now dear students see the simple construction of the metal inert gas welding processes so in the metal inert gas welding process mig it is just similar to the tig gas welding process that is a tungsten inert gas welding process okay only the difference is that the electro rods which is been used in the mig is an consumable in the tig it is a non consumable okay this is consumable means what over here the electro rod is going to be melt itself no extra or another filler metal is been used over here now see the construction this is an welding parts these are the workpiece which is to be weld and this is a torch okay in which the electro rod is been supplied in form of small wire okay a small thick wire is there and over here there are the two feeder rollers are been given feeder rollers means what the, this is a huge roller or the bundle in which the wire is been rolled and by this two roller this wire is been fed inside this electro rod is been uh, what you can say a pressure is been generated for removing out the wire from this roller and with the opposite rotation of these two rollers the pressure is been generated to carry out the electro rods wire and it is been passed through this torch and this is the cut section you can see over here and these are the two guide tubes guide tubes means what in a making the electro rods in a straight way these guide tubes are been used then these are the inert gases in this hollow tube the gases is been released by this inert gas cylinder okay and this is a handle to hold the electro rods to take its own position by the operator and this holder is connected to the main transformer from where the power supply is there ac or dc power supply can be generated from this transformer you can see over here and this uh, workpiece is also connected to the transformer as a second current so this is what the simple construction of the metal inert gas welding process now same whatever you have seen the operation principle of the tig welding process same welding process operations is been carried out over here this torch first initially introduced in from this stage okay this point over here the electro rods is been used for is been touched to the workpiece and the arc is been generated with the spark is been generated with the help of that spark the arc is been generated with the help of that arc the workpiece starts to melt over here okay starts to melt over here so since it is an consumable electrical arc uh, electrod it is an consumable electro uh, um, consumable electrodes of the same material of the workpiece okay in which is to be melted this electrodes is been diffused uh, fused means was uh, mixed with this both the molten metal okay and over here the gas is been introduced same aragon and a carbon dioxide 75% to 25% the gas has been released over here 5 to 10 per 5 to 3 mm gap is been kept when the arc is generated and this gas is been sheltered sheltered or cover the fusion processes or the phenomena as the electrodes moves further once the metal is been fused then the metal starts to solidifies and the welding starts to deposited over here okay when the welding starts to deposited over here same principle that the slag is been removed by the chipping hammer and you, you can get the weld proper weld depositor and the both the metals are been converted into a single form or the single joint okay now this is a consumable electrode wire is there which is near about 0.7 to 2.4 mm which is been used of the same material or the same chemical composition of which the material is to be joined so this is what the simple working procedure of the metal inert gas welding process